10 Best Places to Visit in Ukraine Have you ever visited Ukraine? Many argue that Ukraine is undervisited and less touristy than other parts of Europe, but Ukraine is one of Europe's largest countries. This is a vibrant and beautiful country, perched on the Black Sea, full of beaches, ancient castles, wild forests, stunning countryside, and a friendly attitude from its friendly people. Ukraine has a number of beautiful tourist attractions, including traditional villages and vibrant modern cities, many of which have UNESCO World Heritage Sites and well-preserved historical artifacts. The Gold Dome St. Sophia's Cathedral in Kiev, with 11th century mosaics and paintings, is a highlight. Furthermore, large festivals celebrating its rich culture and history of folk traditions and diverse cultural influences are held on an annual basis. It is also a very affordable travel destination. Despite its political problems, all of this makes Ukraine a unique destination. There are so many places in this country that will make you fall in love with this Eastern European gem. Please like and subscribe to Grace Media as we ride along the 10 best places to visit in Ukraine. 10. Yumen. This city in central Ukraine on the banks of the Yumanka River offers a relaxing stopover between the popular cities of Odessa and Kiev. Yumen was first mentioned as a fortification against Tatar raids in 1626, when it was under Polish rule and has since gone through many stages of occupation. It is best known for the tragic Hadamak rebellions of the 1700s, but it is now a popular Hasidic Jewish pilgrimage site. The tourist attractions in Yumen are well marked, and you'll have no trouble finding your way around this laid back town. Visit the Rabbi Nachman Safiyevka Park, the town obelisk, the Pearl of Love Fountain Show, or the Daily Market. For history buffs, the Vasilian Monastery, 1764, is the city's oldest structure. If you enjoy green spaces, Yumen is a great place to visit. It is a major gardening research center, and Safiyevka Park is ideal for a leisurely afternoon stroll. Nature lovers can sign up for a tree tour at the Dendrological Research Center. Yumen also has some colorful architecture, a museum, World War II memorials, and a beautiful pastel-colored church. 9. Rakiv While its self-proclaimed title as the geographical center of Europe may not be accurate, Rakiv is unquestionably Ukraine's highest city. This mountain town, nestled in the lush Carpathian forests of western Ukraine, is the ideal playground for nature lovers and hikers. This location is ideal for adventurers looking to explore the southern Carpathians as it offers stunning scenery, such as picturesque slopes and swinging footbridges leading across the rushing Tysa River. There isn't a whole lot going on here, but that's the appeal of Rakiv. Head to the peaceful Dyla village for a quiet escape in the mountains and swap the hive of the city for the serenity of the outdoors. For a taste of the local culture, don't miss the Hut Solbrinza festival held in September. This fiesta honors the shepherd who returned from the Carpathian each winter with cheese, wurda, brinza, folk song, and dance. 8. Chernev is a city in Ukraine's northwestern region. Churches, such as the 11th century Transfiguration Cathedral, can be found in Dytinitz Park's historic center. This location is one of Ukraine's oldest cities. It was first mentioned in the Ruse Byantine Treaty between Prince Ol and Byzantium in 1907, but the exact date of establishment is unknown. Chermayev was designated as the second most important Ukrainian center after Kiev in this treaty. Chermayev is the administrative center of the Chermayev Oblast province in northern Ukraine, located on the banks of the Dean River. It has beautiful medieval architecture, particularly Catherine's Church with its golden cupolas and the Five Dome Transfiguration Cathedral from the 12th century. If you like beer, you'll love this place because it's home to Chernayev, a popular Ukrainian beverage. Don't miss out on visiting the two ancient cave monasteries on the city's outskirts or strolling around the 18th century Kachinivka Palace with its beautiful neoclassical architecture, lovely gardens, and lake. 7. Bukovo Ukraine's main skiing destination, 
is an idyllic wintertime destination. In fact, it is the largest ski resort in Europe, surrounded by three mountains, including the highest peaks of the Carpathian Mountains, and the views from this luxury alpine ski resort are simply breathtaking. Bukovl, located high on the slopes of western Ukraine, promises a ton of fun for all ages. With over 50 kilometers of groomed pists and playgrounds, it caters to all skill levels. When you're not testing the powder, visit the snow park, bicycle park, or ski school to learn some new tricks. From December to April is the best time to plan a skiing vacation to Bukovl, but January has the most snow. 6. Chernivtsi This city is located in western Ukraine, at the foot of the Carpathian Mountains, Little Vienna, as it was once part of the Austro-Hungarian Empire, has similar architecture to the Austrian city. But the city is more than just a pretty face. It also has significant historical and cultural significance. This city, according to archaeological discoveries, dates back to the Neolithic era. During the reign of the Principality of Halic, a fortified city stood on the northeastern shoreline. It was dubbed the Black City. Because of the dark color of the city walls, it was most likely destroyed during the Mongol invasion. Some parts of the fortress are still standing today. Its cobblestone streets are lined with laid-back cafes, Baroque buildings, bookshops, and parks, making it the ideal place to unwind and soak up the no-frills, no-fuss atmosphere. Don't miss a visit to the National University, which is one of Ukraine's largest universities. Kamyonets Podol Ski Kamyonets Podol Ski is a Ukrainian city located in western Ukraine. It's famous for its well-preserved old town and the medieval fortress Kamyonets Podolsky Castle, which has several original towers. Castle Bridge, which leads to the city center, was built in the Middle Ages as well. The open-air miniature museum displays replicas of Ukrainian castles. The Podolsky Tavdry National Park is a vast nature preserve that includes historical monuments. It is, in fact, one of the primary reasons tourists visit this fairy tale city. The fortress, which towers over the Smotrix River, is truly magnificent. It is without a doubt one of the most picturesque fortresses in Eastern Europe. But the city is more than just the fortress. Explore the cobbled streets of the well-preserved medieval old town, which is lined with pretty pastel-colored houses, and admire the excellent street art that tells the city's story. Take to the skies on a one-of-a-kind hot air balloon ride. See one of the city's highlights waterfall watching along this Matrichki Canyon and try your hand at archery on the castle bridge. Don't miss the incredible hot air balloon festival in the spring. 4. Chernobyl For those interested in history, Chernobyl promises a dark exploration. It's the site of the infamous nuclear disaster that led to the premature deaths of thousands of people in 1986. Recently revisited in an HBO documentary, The City Exclusion Zone, which is currently an eerie ghost town in northern Kiev Oblast, it is set to become a major tourist attraction. Make sure you go as soon as possible. Inside this city, you will be able to witness the destruction for yourself, the demolished buildings, and abandoned possessions of those who had to escape for their lives. There are guided tours available, giving visitors the opportunity to learn about the tragedy firsthand. While filming is currently prohibited in the exclusion zone, Ukraine's president has promised to lift the ban as part of a major overhaul of the area to make it safer for tourists. 3. Odessa Odessa, in southwestern Ukraine, has an interesting history that is told through its many excellent museums. It was first held by the Greeks, then by the Ottomans, and finally by the Russians. Odessa is now a modern city with stunning Art Nouveau architecture, charming people watching cafes and beautiful beaches. It is known as the Pearl of the Black Sea because it is located on the Black Sea's northwestern shore. In Arcadia, Odessa has a thriving nightlife scene with Ibiza-style nightclubs enviable shopping, and fantastic wineries. Put all of this together, and you have the ultimate summer vacation destination. 
All of this without hordes of international tourists. In Odessa, there is so much to do. Relax at one of the many beach club pools, attend a theater performance, or stroll along the seaside promenade. It's not just what's on the ground level that draws people to Odessa. The city also has a series of intriguing underground catacombs that stretch thousands of kilometers beneath the city. 2. Helviv is the largest city in western Ukraine, located about 70 kilometers from the Polish border, and it has a historic center that is well worth exploring. The capital was established in 1240 and named after Leo, the oldest son of Ruthenia's king, before changing hands several times between the Polish and the Russian, before finally becoming independent in 1991. Elvak is jam-packed with monuments, museums, and historic buildings, as well as archaeological finds dating back to the 5th century. The city, dubbed one of Ukraine's most popular cultural hubs, is brimming with art galleries, including the Elviv National Art Gallery, which houses over 50,000 works of art. From opera and ballet performances to a charming cafe culture, there is no shortage of activities for a cultural day out. Tucked down, narrow side streets are a plethora of quirky bars and kippas. 1. Kiev the capital, Kiev, is unquestionably the most popular tourist destination in Ukraine. It is located in north-central Ukraine. This European city packs a punch with its striking Soviet architecture, monasteries, golden dome churches, and charming streets. Furthermore, it is still very underrated, so there aren't many tourist traps here. Kiev is one of the oldest cities in Eastern Europe, dating back to 482 AD. It is now distinctly Ukrainian, having faced both Russian and German occupation. Indeed, Kiev played an important role in the development of both the medieval East Slavic civilization and the Ukrainian nation as we know it today. Modern Kiev is a whirlwind of activity. To learn more about Eastern Europe's fascinating history, visit one of the city's many bars, people watch at a sidewalk cafe, or visit one of the museums one of Europe's largest open-air museums is the Museum of Folk Architecture and Ethnography. The most popular attraction in Kiev, however, is unquestionably Kiev Petrus Labra, one of Ukraine's oldest and most important monasteries. Don't pass up the opportunity to walk down Andreevsky Descent, a steep cobblestone street lined with Art Nouveau-style houses with gargoyles. Bring your cultural a game because Kiev is a popular destination for theater, opera, and musical performances. Ukraine has a lot to offer, from its beautiful and unique architecture to its dreamy and scenic cities, vast green landscapes, gorgeous beaches, and charming lakes, as well as its historical museum. You won't have to worry about your budget when visiting this remarkable country because it is an exceptionally budget-friendly travel destination. Visit this country and learn more about it. Please like, share, and comment, as well as subscribe to Grace Media and enable notifications for more amazing videos.